thank you for joining me. My name is Haley, coming to you from www.wigvault.com. We are the internet's absolute low price leader on the highest quality human hair wigs. And today I'm wearing a Raquel Welch black label wig called the Contessa. The Contessa is a Eastern European wig with a thinner, finer texture than most of the other wigs on the market that are made of Chinese and Indian hair. So today I'm wearing the Contessa in the lightest color that it comes in, and that is the BL10. And um, I also have the guidebook here so that we can discuss this product more in depth, in depth and just teach you all the ins and outs of this product. So this is the, um, definitely the leader of the pack when it comes to the luxury and the design. This is an ultra thin, 100% hand tied cap with uh, various kind of polyurethane attachments that's going to make it help to stay on your head better. I do want to take off this wig and kind of show you the inside of it, um, but first I wanted to discuss the color. So this wig here, it comes in 10 available shades, um, ranging from BL1 all the way up to BL10. So those are traditional um, color levels, BL1 being the black, and then two, three, four, five, so on, um, up until the 10, which is kind of your palest light blonde. And um, so if you followed Raquel Welch wigs in the past, you know that for example, their most popular blonde is the 1488 or the 1621. That's a totally different um, color ring and different idea than the BL colors. So these are classic color levels um, that have not been modified and customized by highlights and lowlights. So um, this wig came to me nice and pale blonde, and I went ahead and added a custom root onto the wig, and I may or may not add some foils at some point, but I did want to start out with a little bit of a root to make it more natural. Um, so let's go ahead and show you the um, inside. This is a Swiss lace. I'm loving the Swiss lace. It is ultra fine, thin. It has almost a skin colored um, tone to it. It truly looks impressive. It looks like it's growing right out of my forehead. I could easily wear this wig up and back, up in a clip. It looks amazing. And then um, from the inside, we've got those 100% hand knotted hairs throughout. We do have the silicone gel to keep it to stay in place. Um, on, on the sides here, we don't have like a fabric ear tab, but it's just like a um, welded poly ear tab. The top, we've got a single knit um, silk base. So this actually has the same color and kind of opacity as a silk top, but it's actually a thin single knit, so it's going to be very, very breathable. One thing I can tell you is that it's been very tightly pulled. I don't think we're gonna have any slipping of hairs on this cap. It's a really well-made piece. Um, the cap has a light amount of stretch, but not a ton. So this is a structured wig. If you're looking for something that's gonna stay super close to the head um, and wear like it's your own hair, this wig is going to do that. Um, what I would say is that the Contessa is a wig that's really gonna shine on somebody that doesn't have any hair of their own. So if your hair is super thin to the point where you barely have any, this would be a good wig for you. If you've got um, alopecia in any level, this would be a, a better wig for you. If you've got alopecia areata, you've just got little small patches, you would really need to have significant loss until this type of product is good for you because it's really going to um, go on the bare head a lot better. One thing I noticed is that the fit of this one is awesome. When you compare a wig um, with this alopecia style cap, compared to like the John Renault line that has the same thing, this fit is entirely better. It's, it's just so much better. This is a, they did a really nice job and I think probably did extensive market research, measuring of heads and things like that before they made this cap. So it's really, really nice. Um, I do find that this cap fits petite average or average heads. This is not a cap made for large heads. It fits me real snug. Um, I have a very average head and I don't have any hair. So, okay, let's see if there's anything else important that we want to tell you. We've got the single silk monofilament top, temple to temple Swiss lace. Uh, no, it doesn't. It says temple to temple Swiss lace, but this Swiss lace just goes from one end of the forehead to the other. So important to note, sometimes reviews are helpful because even what you read isn't always accurate. So this is a forehead lace from one side of my forehead to the other, does not extend to the temples. And then we've got the anti-slip skin straps. Um, hair length is 14 inches from the bottom. So this is a nice long wig. And then the shortest hair on this wig is 12 inches. So we don't have any um, short choppy layers. 
We've got all long, flowy um, hair where kind of like the, op the opportunity is endless for you to customize this piece into any cut that you want. So we'll go ahead and just try this on. Again, it fits snug, it fits light, uh, light and sheer, and it has a remarkably natural lace front hairline. Um, one of the nice things about the Contessa, because I have sold a few of these in the past, um, is that they really, the blondes really hold up. And that's what impacted my decision to buy this Contessa um, for my new wig. Every Christmas I get a new wig, so this is it. But um, it's just that I was in search of something and I wanted to try something different in the blondes. Something in blondes that's meant to be blonde. In European hair, it's a lot easier to lighten European hair to be blonde and for that hair to really hold up and not get dry. So what I'm kind of counting on with this one is a long lasting blonde wig. A lot of times blonde human hair wigs don't last as long as the brunettes, but I'm counting on this one to last me a long time. So I think that the Contessa is an excellent investment piece. I've had clients buy these and have been very happy with them, how they've held up for a long period of time. And so I think that if you're looking for a high quality blonde hair wig and you just absolutely have to have that platinum hair, then the Contessa or the Princessa are excellent options. Um, also, we do provide here at Wig Vault like, things that are, that are really important to the customizing. So like the custom lace trim, which I'm excellent at, and I'm the one that would be doing that for you. Um, as well as, for example, if you wanted roots, highlights, lowlights, all of that can be done um, here at Wig Vault. So I hope that you found this in, um, definitely informational for you. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to email at um, wigvault at gmail.com and then shop our um, competitively priced website, www.wigvault.com. Thank you so much. Have a beautiful hair day.